Today we'll be downloading EDR crash data from this 2016 Hyundai Accent. We'll be using the GIT Hyundai EDR retrieval tool to access and download the data through the vehicle's OBD port. This video demonstrates how to perform a download using the Hyundai EDR tool. The procedures are identical when downloading data from a Kia using the Kia EDR tool. There are a few things to know about Hyundai and Kia EDR supported vehicles before we get started. 2013 and newer Hyundai and Kia vehicles sold in the United States are EDR supported, with one caveat. 2013 models must have a production date of September 2012 or newer to be supported. The production date is typically found on the vehicle information placard located on the driver door jam of the vehicle. Start by preparing your equipment in the vehicle. Connect the DLC cable to the top of the VCI. Connect the VCI to your PC using the USB cable. Connect the DLC cable to the vehicle's OBD port. Power is supplied to the VCI through the vehicle's OBD port. Press the power button on the VCI. The power LED should illuminate at this point. Now, turn the vehicle's ignition switch to the on position to power up the vehicle's airbag control unit. Power up your PC and open the Hyundai EDR software program. An EDR disclosure notice will appear each time you open the Hyundai or Kia EDR software program. Click OK. You'll be prompted to connect the EDR retrieval tool to the vehicle and power up the equipment. Click OK. The software will confirm connection between your PC and the VCI. Click on the Vehicle Search icon on the toolbar. The EDR tool will connect to the vehicle's communication network, read the VIN, and display it as indicated here. Enter the username, case number, crash date, tire size, and notes related to your case here. Then click OK. The direct to module connection cable required for the ACU installed in this vehicle will be displayed at this point. This is not applicable to us since we're performing the download through the OBD port. Click OK. We're now ready to start the download. Click on the Retrieve button. The circle next to the Retrieve button will turn red during the data collection process. Several messages will be displayed indicating the process of the download. When completed, the EDR report will be displayed on your screen. You must save the report at this time. Hover over the top of the screen to display the save and print options. Click on the Save button. Enter a file name and location to save the file on your computer. Then click Save. The EDR file has been saved as a secure PDF document. And that's how to perform a DLC download using the Hyundai EDR Retrieval Tool. For more information on Hyundai, Kia, and other EDR retrieval tools, visit CrashDataGroup.com or call us at 800-280-7940.